This is an experiment by Perendev in the production of hydrogen using a method of electrolysis. In front of you, you'll see a container. On the left, a little capture jar. And in the background, a battery, 12 volt, 188 amp battery used in a large automobile. On top of the container, you will see three protrusions. The left one is the outlet tap. The center is the pressure gauge. And on the right, the emergency relief valve. If the pressure exceeds six bar, that pressure relief valve will acti activate. We're now going to turn on the system and I will zoom in on the plates. You can see the interaction taking place. Power is now on and immediately we get an immense um, amount of power coming out and on the right, on the left you can see the, the capture jar with the hydrogen bubbles being produced. The temperature in the jar at the moment is 25.7. This will increase as electrolysis takes place and the temperature will increase. With the increase of temperature, hydrogen production becomes much more efficient. We're going to prove that what we are producing is hydrogen. We're going to insert a flame into the bottle. And you can see immediately the hydrogen explodes. The production of this system would be sufficient to run a small motor vehicle, although the container will be reduced in size. We're now going to close the valve and increase the pressure in the container we'll take the pressure up to one bar see the pressure is increasing now we're at approximately a half a bar That is after approximately 30 seconds of uh, running. I must point out that although we are using a car battery, once the battery is in a motor vehicle, the motor vehicle normally charges around 14 volts and um, smaller units, 45 amps and uh, larger units, anything up to 80 amp hours that is derived from the alternator. However, we are only drawing in this experiment 10 amps from the battery, 12 volt and 10 amps. You can see the power is now increasing up to one bar. We will again do the lighting test and open the tap so that you can see that we are in fact producing hydrogen. Okay, convinced even the most skeptical. Thank you.